project's owner, uh, which is presented by Mr. Stephen Howard, uh, who is the chief marketing officer of Acadia's from the Switzerland. So, Stephen, the stage is yours, please. Thank you so much. Um, can we start with the slides? Thank you. Thank you for having uh, Arcadia here today at the Belt and Road Summit 2022. Next slide. Uh, everybody knows about global warming and uh, we know that uh, concrete is responsible about 8% of the CO2 emissions globally. To replace concrete, we have one valuable resource, and that is construction waste. Today, most of this construction waste lies in landfills because we dig holes to get the materials out. Then we build the buildings, and finally, when the buildings are crushed, we dispose them again in landfills. So what we are doing is we are throwing away things that we could use. Arcadia recycles construction and wood waste and can make objects out of many shapes, bricks, tiles, tables, or even buildings. Next slide. With Arcadia, we can save about 80% CO2 compared to traditional production processes. How do we do that? We select natural bacteria to create biomaterials for solutions for a better world. And this could be, here are a few uh, potential usages, by uh, using construction waste, by the stabilization of land, of shores or of islands, building water reservoirs, lakes or pipes in areas where it's very difficult to transport normal material, and also to create for agriculture uses semi-permeable surfaces to have a better water management together with the layer. And finally, one of our dreams is a stop desertification. Next slide. Uh, what we need is the Arcadia bacteria. This is indigenous good bacteria and the Arcadia nutrition. So that is the diet the bacteria lives on. And then we add from the client side, the raw materials like concrete, crushed concrete, waste wood, other wastes, or even, and that is very interesting, you can use that also with round sand. You ignite the process by just adding water. Arcadia is a low CO2 process. We need only uh, CO2 uh, spending for the Arcadia nutrition when we produce that. And it's a low energy process because what you need is to mix the in ingredients and then to keep the bacteria at an ideal temperature between 25 to 30 degrees uh, before you harden and dry it out. So the process itself is that is recalled, we are doing by mimic nature. The Acadia bacteria produce a natural adhesive made out of calcium carbonate. That is exactly the stuff where corals and seashells are made of. The bacteria are building a kind of mesh around the crushed particles of waste and keeps them together in a very strong way. This process is called MICP, Microbial Introduced Calcium Carbonate Precipitation. Next slide. We can produce any kind of forms from traditional bricks up to art designs because it is going mainly with the mold. So you fill in the material into the mold uh, and after seven to 28 days, depending on the hardening of the material that you're looking for, the product is ready. Can it be recycled again? Yes, it can be recycled again and again. Just add always 5% new waste because uh, that helps to keep the quality standards at the level that is uh, requested. Arcadia works with several waste, man uh, waste materials such as excavation, construction, wood, mansory, mine wastes or glass. We're working on more materials for the future and it can come out in different shapes, as you see here, a few examples. And it is, it, uh, we're working on finally also building complete houses out of recycled wood or recycled concrete. Next slide. Is it strong enough? And uh, we validated that for 30 megapascal, which is construction grade for the construction waste and about nine megapascal, that is about the strength of a tile for the wood waste. 
when you mix the material, you can reach out different various technology, technology performances, like better acoustics, better isolation, or a different kind of strength. Next slide. Uh, this is the team. It is led by Luca Colzani, the CEO and founder, and the team mainly uh, pre, uh, is built out of the research and developers, which you will see on the next slide, is what we say, next slide, uh, what we say, it's the competitive advantage of our company. Because the R&D team, we have scientists like microbiologists, molecular genetics, and chemical engineers bringing all that forward, finding out what is technical feasible to see if the ideas work and how we get met better uh, re recycling of various types of waste. And of course, they're working on the patents to secure our IP. The team is pretty innovative, working on new raw materials, better product and processes, more effective designs and shapes for the future but also very important for the commercial use, improved production processes. Next slide. The product strategy for bioconcrete is here. As outlined before, it is the bacteria and the nutrition that Arcadia produces and delivers. From the client side, we just add the crust construction waste, crust wood waste, or whatever it is, or the mixing material and we help to improve the processes economically and ecologically. Uh, we're also working on um, improvements. At the moment, we're uh, working on 3D printing of the Arcadio biomaterial because we believe this is the next big step to bring such a process further. And also we work with hybrid concrete because there are some areas it makes sense to go with a mix. On the next slide. Uh, we have the go-to-market strategy. It is a new area. It is environmental. So we will try to use governments, policymakers, NGOs, corporates, ESG drivers, and impact investors as promoters for our uh, product and solutions. The product pricing strategy is a percentage of the savings that you have in productions. And for some of the countries, like here in Europe, uh, the percentage of the savings that is uh, what you have with the CO2 certificates. That brings us to the sales. The sales has to be regional. That is why we're here and we're looking for partners. It's a B2B sales by industry. The key account teams are always built together out of a sales engineer and an R&D resource because it is a complex product that has to be adjusted once. The advertising, straightforward, uh, directly B2B contacts. We are talking about circular economy, climate change discussions as content drivers, and that is also the core of our public relations strategy, carbon footprint reduction, sustainability, and circular economy at an affordable price. Do something well for the environment. Next slide. The Arcadia business process. Uh, we have on the left side, Arcadia, again, the first supplier of the bacteria or any change you look for in the future, the know-how to start the operations locally or in the country, and of course, bags of nutrition uh, for uh, the Arcadia bacterias. In the middle, you see then when all that brought together at the client side, we believe this is a very good business model because it was done in the past with seeds and fertilizers or with seeds and pesticides from very well-known large chemical companies. So we believe also for the good in the environment, such a process will work. Next slide, please. And a summary, we have validated Arcadia for excavation and construction wastes up to 30 megapascals for wood wastes, glued wood-based panels, and also a mixture with clay. We filed an Italian patent in 2022 with the title Methods of Increasing the Calcium Carbonate Concentration in Geomaterials. So not the bacteria, but the process is in the patent. We have the strength that we have. The team is innovation, R&D, and experience in circular economy projects. We are looking for a partner company that has unlike us, because we are strong in R&D, large scale production and market access experience. And we would to like to build a joint venture together with them to bring in a large scale production know-how 
from our side and roll that out. And also, finally, look for new patterns in the future uh, built together with our GVs for specific waste management treatment with the MICP methodology. Last slide. Thank you so much for uh, the time, and uh, we would look forward to uh, visit uh, to welcome you in our exhibition booth at the Belt and Road Summit 2022, where you can also find more and additional material for download. Thank you, uh, and now giving back to Peter. Thank you, Stephen, uh, for introducing such impressive projects to us. I like recycling, and environmental production is always under the subjects of human beings.